I'm going to show you how to run a Tukey test, a postdoc test for the ANOVA family in SPSS. Now, the Tukey test basically does every pairwise comparisons of whatever the DV scores are for the individual levels of specific grouping variables, right? Your, your categorical IVs. So I'm just going to show you instead of shoot my mouth off here. All right, so we're going to run a quick ANOVA to see if there's a significant difference in the number of push-ups. That's our DV, the number of push-ups between the military branches. So military branches is one IV, but it's got six individual levels. Say that again. Uh, military branch is a single IV, but it's got six different little subgroups or what we call levels. Right? The Marines, the soldiers, the sailors, the airmen, coast guardsmen, and the new space guardians. Bah, bah, bah. And again, the DV is the number of push-ups. So we're going to go to Analyze, General Linear Model, Univariato, Oop. and let me reset this so you don't get all the good stuff here. We'll push this so you can see it. Please hold. Right, so military branch is your fixed factor. Push-ups is your DV. Always go to Options. We always want the descriptives, spec size, power, homogeneity variance. Click Continue. Here's your post hoc box. Beep, beep. Now, you click over your grouping factor, your categorical variable, and then look at them all. You can do them all at the same time, right? There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 10, 12, 14. There's 14 different postdoc tests right here, but we just use Tukey. And I got to admit, I love saying Tukey. Tukey, Tukey, Tukey. All right, so Tukey test. Click OK. And it takes a little practice on how to interpret a Tukey test, so let me pull it up and show you. So first of all, that's how many are in each group. There's your means. We're going to come back here to see if there's a significant difference. I can see some high ones in there, right? The Space Guardians are way up there. The Marines and the Airmen are way down there. No offense. This is made up data, you guys, so don't freak out on me. And the means test is okay. And it is significant, right? So, but we don't know between which two groups there's a significant difference and there might be more than one it probably is with this data set so let's pull it up and let me see if I can make it bigger uh -uh -uh. so there's the Tukey test so how you look at this is you, you look at the sig value right? scroll down so there's a point zero zero eight so that means the, there's a significant difference between the marines and the sailors see that and then the next one, this one is less than 0.05. So that means there's a significant difference between the number of push-ups between the Marines and the Airmen. And then that's what you do, right? Here's so soldiers and Airmen. Soldiers and Space Guardians. These are all the two-way comparisons. Sailors and Marines. So now what you're going to do is you're going to start getting duplicates, right? So when you get down here to the bottom, guys, whatever the, whatever the significant difference is between the number of push-ups for the Space Guardians and the other branches has already showed up above, but it'll, it'll show you right here. So, Space Guardians, Airmen, Sailors, Soldiers, but now you don't know who did more, right? It says there's a difference, but who did more? It doesn't say that. So, what you have to do is you have to scroll back up to the mean box in your descriptive statistics, and you just look at the numbers, right? So, the Space Guardians are, are significantly higher than a couple of these other groups. The Marines are significantly higher than these other groups. And that, that's how it's read right there. So again, last time is when you pull up your Tukey test, scroll your finger down the SIG column. Anything under .05 is considered a significant difference. That's it. MGZ out.